what up, what up? Just want to give a quick little message out to people, man. I see a lot of people on social media going crazy, scared to death of this coronavirus. You know, I mean, hey, y'all got to take care of your bodies. You know, quit eating junk. <laughs> but uh, all jokes aside, you know, God never gave us the spirit of fear, but power, love, and a sound mind, you know, which is self-control. You know, um, a lot of people are worried and in fear. You know, God has not, like, given us the spirit of fear. So where is that spirit of fear coming from? If it's not from God, you know what it is, you know, um, so it should tell us whatever we bind on earth shall be bound in heaven. Whatever we loose on earth shall be loosed in heaven. Binding these spirits. This spirit of fear that's coming from this coronavirus is an infirmity spirit. You know, so come up against it by the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. You know, everybody sing about the blood of Jesus Christ, but, you know, really dig into it. You know, what the blood of Jesus Christ does for us. You know, I'm talking to the believers. The non-believers, they don't care. They're not going to listen. So, you know, just encouragement for, you know, all the true Christians out there, you know, um, and to be absent from this body is to be present with the Lord, man. If all else fell and we end up dying, hey, we're going to be present with the Lord anyway. So think about the the good side effect of this. You know what I'm saying? If you really save, you have nothing to worry about. You don't have nothing to worry about. Matter of fact, he told us in 1 Peter 5, 7, cast all our cares upon, upon him because he cares for us. You know, so you start to feel that you scared and this is just heavy on your mind. Hey, cast all your cares upon him. Like I said, uh, like the word says, you know, so this is a word of encouragement. Y'all don't let the devil overtake your mind. Just want to say that. I want you to have a blessed night, blessed day, wherever you are, you know, um, stand your word. He bring perfect peace to those whose mind is stayed upon him. Think about that. Praise and worship, fasting, you know, in your word, keep your mind on him. We're talking about Jesus, we're talking about the Father, we're talking about the Holy Spirit, man. Keep your mind on that. Let that just be all you think about. He got your back. He loves his people. And to back it up, for God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten son that whoever believed in him should not perish but have everlasting life. For God so loved the the world. All right, I'm going to holler at y'all later, man. Grace and peace. Much love. Be encouraged.